Hey guys, Nightwing for 50 here, and welcome back to Fantasy Life. Uh, I totally forgot what I was doing. So, a few things I will say before the video kind of starts is I did change a lot of settings. Not in the game, but for recording wise. Because uh, I'm testing things out right now. Okay, no, I'm not doing that. I'm doing this. Friends of Sultan. I mean, why? I think we should go and see them. We don't need a reason. Okay, I heard that has Magic's library. Okay, library. Library should be around here. Are you the library? No, you're not. So I changed a lot. So right now I'm recording at 720p, 60 FPS instead of the uh, 1980 with 30 FPS. That's going straight to the market. So I don't know if there's going to be any significance. Uh, but the Overwolf has a new option for bitrate. Uh, yeah. So I didn't touch it. I just left it at 8,000. So I don't know what's going to happen. I think it's more up, isn't it? Oh, yeah, I haven't been to the library in a long time in this game. So yeah, new settings, new stuff. I am messing around with it also I think I upgrade the quality instead of being super fast it's now fast or something I don't know what that means all right all I know is I changed some settings it may or may not be recording right now you guys may or may not see this video whatever happens happens wow this library is huge I bet they have books about everything Who's making all that racket? Keep quiet in the library, honestly. Ah, Lady Demona. Hmm, so it was you two. You need to watch your manners. <laughs> this really is an amazing library. It makes uh, Castler's library look tiny, but of course. Uh, El Magic is a paradise of any scholar. You insult us by even comparing it to Castler. I'm sorry? What are you doing here, Lady Demona? I'm gathering the books necessary for Daemon's training. The knowledge of our ancestors shall be passed on to him. So you're going to give Daemon his training? I thought that that was the job of the prior Dark Sultan. Hmm. My good for nothing husband just floats around all day with no interest in Daemon's training. He's so irresponsible. He's always saying, let him grow up as he pleases. What nonsense. But you can't make him study all the time either. He'll just get exhausted. Besides, everyone in El Magic already adores him. Does he really need any training? You are <laughs> impertinent, little butterfly. Sticking your nose into other people's business? I'm sorry. I understand that Diamond's a kind boy of a good intentions. However, one could not possibly rule a nation of kindness alone. It is my duty to raise Diamond to be a wise and just ruler. I will do anything in my power to fulfill that role, even if my son despises me for it. Wow. That's your true wish. So that is your greatest desire? Well, your wish has been heard. Huh? What was that light? You're, you're sparkled. Rather arrogantly, I might add. Hmm. Perhaps it was my imagination. Anyway, what are you two doing here? We wanted to find out some more about the creation of Rivera. Well, that is a laudable pursuit. I'm sure there is much you two could learn in this library. And seeing as you are, by some miracle, diamond for, for, ahem, <clears throat> oh. Seeing as you are his friends, you out to educate yourselves to be worthy of that honor. Um, of course. How do you learn to be someone's friend in a library? So there is a particular book you are looking for, I shall help you find it. Also, reading in the dark can be quite straining on your eyes. You should take this. Hey! Thank you very much. Let's be sure to read plenty of books tonight. I'm sure we could learn a lot. However, uh oh, is there a fee? Just back. Make sure you mind your behavior in the library from now on. Um, we'll be careful. Even what? Yeah, okay, we'll be careful. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I don't think you can. There is like little books you can read. What's the point? Someone's like, 
picked up wicked ores deposits. Old ruins and caves still abound in large, hard excavated ore deposits. It would seem that these deposits come known as boss rocks among the miners. One of our most remarkable characteristics are challenged, challengeable, changeable sweet spots. Jesus. Yeah, another is their ability to recover HP over time, making slow ore extraction out of the question. Okay, yeah, I, I, yes, 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 yes. I know where some of that stuff is. Ores, is it elf? Lightning. It's up here. So, <laughs> this looks like the moon. This looks like a poop. No, that's water. Elements, light, wind, water, fire, and earth. These are five of the magical elements. Yes, indeed they are. But yeah, they give you a little hints on how to stuff in the game. Also, in the library there is like a thing I forget you can do. But it's to reset your stats, which is cool. Welcome to the Magic Library of Magic. We have many books in history written from the Dark Sultan's dynasty's perspective. Not sure how much of it is true though. Oh. Okay. I think it was like, I think this right here I would activate at one point. I don't know how or when. But I never used it. Alright, well, that's the library. On our way out. Hey, what do you want? That's my Alexa. Oh, I always have always been more for friends. I can use it now. I want to leave me nominate. I'm a huge fear. But to do that, I'm going to need one massive. I'm taking a huge, huge big beak. Hey. Do I not have that? Nope. Alright, that's easy to get. That's a boss. And a puerto. Nope. <laughs> Bad habits. That's the nice thing. Also, yeah, I was like, huh, I remember there was a chest up there. Cool. I'm already two steps ahead of myself. Run. Ah, Alright, I hope this is recording really well. Because I'm touching stuff that's not... See, because I want to touch things. I don't like doing stuff. Right, if you've done something over and over again, you just want to change it. You know, you want to see if there's anything new. Oh, cutscene right away. Oh, it looks like happy faces. Diamond? Well, di diamond? Yeah, we're back, Diamond. Ah, oh, welcome back, Nike. I hope nothing bad has happened while we've been away. No, thanks to your efforts, all is well again. Father is back and even mother is in high spirits. Also, I've made a decision. I have decided that I shall take over the world. What? Are you serious? Heh, <laughs> well, sort of, I suppose. Of course I don't mean to use it, my magic knights to take over Rivera by force. What do you mean? I wish to make a world where there is no war. If you think of ruling the world as bringing everyone together as one, and that's the kind of world domination I want. A world dominated by peace and unity. <laughs> hmm. Phew, you had me worried. You're quite the trickster too, aren't you? Thankfully, the world is currently at peace, with no wars to speak of. But there is the great danger that currently threatens Rivera. However, I believe it is the perfect opportunity for all Rivera and Rivera's realms to join together as one. As Dark Sultan of Magic, I shall work to preserve this peace for the future. That's your true wish? Peace? Not domination? Wow. Is that what you want most, Diamond? Well, your wish has been heard. I must even speak of all the heroes I have sent running home up to now. I realize everyone will understand my actions if I, ta I take the time to speak with them. Well, everyone except that last one. Magnificus? Yes, it may take some time to change his mind. Whenever I approach him, he jumps up and runs away, quick as a flash. Oh, well, at least you didn't have to be confined to the ruins, right, now. Now we can go on all sorts of adventures together. We can show you around Kessler. I'm afraid I can't yet. I have only just officially ascended the throne, and there are many issues I must see, too. However, I am sure that I will be able to join you at some time in the near future. Could I ask you to wait until then? Of course we will. That's what friends are for. Waiting. Right, Knight? Yes. 
friends. That's a word I barely knew the meaning of until recently. Thank you, both of you. Knight, I'd like to give you this. Money, 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 money. No! A cape? Is it the same as yours? Oh, well, it's not exactly the same. I thought that would be a little embarrassing. I chose this one as I thought it would suit you well. Try it out, Knight. I'm sure it'll look great. I mean, I do like capes. But you see my beast necklace I think I have on? That's better. Well, I hope you like it. Alright. Uh, okay, well, let's go ahead and... Technically, I have still 20 minutes of story time. So, we gotta continue the story, but while I'm running technically back, I'm gonna teleport back home because I'm not running all the way back. I need to go see if I have the best armor and all that thing. Right? I have to go to that champion's thing. Uh. See, that's the one thing that sucks. If I don't buy this house, I have to run back here every time. I don't like that. I mean, I think I'm taking granted over what I had in my 3DS. I had all the houses in every spot. I was just easily able to teleport. Alright, let's see. I have the best sword. Let's see if I have this. Red, oh my god, all red. I have a good selection of money though. Let's go see, spring water. No, I think someone wanted this. The apples. Sell those. Come on, see what. What else do I want to sell? That gold, or copper technically. So that, whatever this is, so that. Don't need it. I need to. I need to customize my house. If not, leave this all. This gives me two magic defense. Cable of a jagged edge creates better fearsome look. I like it, but defense over magic defense, I don't know about that. Alright, well, let's go ahead and see what we can do. We said we're going to teleport, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Map. I want to go to the guild, yes, please. Because that's the closest to closest to where I should just teleport a horn. Wait a minute, right? Who am I missing? Wait, floater. Nah, no, I just gotta do blitz check. All right. I should just gone home. I thought I had to go to. Oh wow. <laughs> oh okay. Um, customize rearrange. Can I move items? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I wish this was there. You know what? You get to sit there. Lamp? I mean, you look cool. I put you there. Wall. Oh. That works. This chair, you still can. You don't want that there. No, alright. There you go. Alright, boom. No, I actually want this there and this. Uh, you can't be there. Crud, alright, boom. 
All right, fine. We deal with this. All right, boom. You can still look at the king's. Oh wait, no, 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 wait. No, rotate, rotate. Boom. Now every time I wake up, I see the king's. Uh, storage. Yes, I'm gonna store. Item stored. Let's see, what else can we store in here that I don't want? Oh, the night stuff. Yeah. And the shield. Boom. All right. Hey, Flair, how are you liking your new lamp? I can help you. Bless check. Alright, see how much we did. Nice. Even better, yes. Alright. We're slowly coming cl uh, close to the end of the game, and I'm kind of sad. I don't want a pet. Horse riding, bigger storage. I don't want bigger storage. Mystery fair. Ooh. That's actually something that you kind of do want. Happy audio. Yeah. It seems what it wishes to speak with you. And I, could we talk for a while? You mean the whole day? Yes, please. Yes, save my game. Y yay. Uh, water, <laughs> water break. Never mind. I can't believe Magnificus still wants to fight a diamond. Talk about obstinate. He calls himself a hero, but he's more of a Pierre and Butch type. A <laughs> Pierre and Butch type. I bet Magnificus talks more in one day than Odin does in a whole year. <laughs> All right, buddy. We don't we don't go that far. Wow, once I start talking, I just can't stop. We better get to bed. You know, I was just thinking, wouldn't it be fun to meet another talking animal, you know, like a talking bear or something? <laughs> oh, Flutter. How do you know stuff that I don't? Where, do, where does Flutter even sleep? Father, I've been thinking a lot lately about where wishes come from. A wish comes from the heart, and the heart is where we keep our wishes. Yes, everyone in Rivera has a secret wish. I know that Knight does, and we all have a heart. I do, Noelia does, and you do too, Father. But I keep wondering, what if there are others in Rivera who also have hearts? <clears throat> I mean, apart from humans. What about the monsters and the spirits too? Don't they have hearts? And if so, do they keep their wishes there? That is a good question. I've been killing a lot of monsters. Do they have hearts? Probably. Wakey, wakey, rise and shine. It's your dependable neighborhood postman. You got another letter from the king, you lucky duck. Oh, stamps and envelopes. A gruesome, treesome approaches. But that's not the right place, is it, bro? Come back. Wait for me. Where are you going, bro? I go... Good postman is never distracted from duty, no matter what madness he encounters. So, yeah, a home run. The crowd goes wild. Boom. Easy. Okay, everything all set up. <clears throat> so we have 11 minutes of story time. So I don't know what's gonna happen once it hits 30, because then that means I cut the story and I go grind. Dear Knight, we discovered something incredible. Hurry to the royal court so I can show you. King Eric the Kessler. That's the fifth letter. Do you hear familiar voices at the front door there? I wonder what was going on. Oh, a letter from the king. Hmm, I wonder what it could be. Sounds urgent. We've already got all the goddess treasures. Maybe he's figured out something important. Knight, to the castle. Here we go. Tale of Lunaris, part five. Great forest, great spirit.
Hello, hello. Do I have anything? I don't have anything for you guys. Well, I guess I'm not getting that cash money. Right. Hello, guard. Why is there only one guard at the front gates of the castle? That don't make no sense. Cutscene. It's gonna be a cutscene. If it's not, I'm gonna cry. Nope. Two more steps and then it's cutscene. There you are, Knight. I've been waiting, waiting frantically. Laura, please. It was my summons. I'm the one who has been waiting. I've been waiting more. <laughs> Enough. You too. You're making fools of yourselves in front of Knight. Wow, everyone's here, huh? Yes, yes. Thank you for coming. Knight and Flutter too. I've called you here on urgent business. It is about the goddess treasures. It's a big surprise. Hughes has been investigating. He has delved deep into the lore. The lore of yeah, this game. Is that not right, Hughes? Yes, your highness. And you have hit upon a discovery. Is that not right, Hughes? Yes, your highness. And now you will share your findings with us. Is that not right, Hughes? Er, I thought we were in a hurry. There is no time for dramatics. I shall simply explain. Huh? Oh, very well. Proceed, Hughes. There are more than three goddess treasures. What? Really? Permit me to explain. The legend of Lunaris tells that the goddess entrusted a treasure to each land in Rivera. In other words, to Castellar, Port Puerto, and El Magic. But that was not all. I thought those were the three lands of Rivera. There aren't any others. We have overlooked the fourth, for its ruler is not human. <clears throat> not human? The governor of all monsters and beasts, the Great Spirit, now all but a myth. Hughes and I are both on the opinion that the fourth and final god is treasure. It's concealed somewhere within that mythical fourth land. My, my loyal subjects, you must know what I ask of you. You bet we do. We're going on another adventure, aren't we? Indeed, bring me that final treasure, my dynamic duo. We will, we will, but where is it? Yes, that's the only snag. Is that not right, Hughes? Yes, your highness, this great spirit's land, we know it not. It has only been spoken of in legend. We do not know if it is still exists here in this world. I mean, you got no clue at all. <laughs> that's Flutter, that's a great sum summarization right there. Precisely. A mysterious adventure indeed, is it not? The great spirit, Danuta. My queen. Do you know something about the great spirit? Ah, I think I understand. The great spirit's land must be... Dearest? No. Wow, she didn't even let him speak. I have not yet spoken. I know what you were about to say. That place is out of bounds. It is a forbidden forest. A forest is how they desire it. Yes, but if the world ends, they'll be going down with the rest of us. How can we just give up when we come this far, when we already have three treasures? My queen, if you know something, then for the good of Rivera, I bid you speak. <laughs> no. I must think about it first. We're all gonna die! Mother, my wife can communicate with monsters and spirits. Can she really? I never knew that. <clears throat> Funny enough, all the royal Castellan females can. Laura also possesses such a power. That is how she speaks to the Nap Dragon. Return to the topic at hand, Queen Ophelia seemed to know something. She said it their desire, but who are they? Hmm. I may be able to explain it, though it is not my place to do so. An urgent report, your majesty. No interruptions. Can't you see we're busy here? But your majesty, apparently a doomstone has fallen into the Elderwood. In the Elderwood, of all places. The report seems legit, your majesty, and apparently it's a huge doomstone. A huge one? How huge is huge? Um, well, apparently it made a colossal sound when it fell. Who cares how big it is? Indeed, your majesty. This is no time to be squabbling or over specifics. The other world is chock full of monsters. If they all become violent at once, well... Hughes, to action! Gather the troops and proceed immediately to the other world. Come, soldier! Sir, yes, sir. What about me? Nine Flutter. You two are seasoned pros by now when it comes to neutralizing Doomstones. Accompany the troops and provide assistance. Yes, sir, yes. 
a fine soldiery response. I struggle over whether to tell you this or not, but there is a secret within the Elderwood. No, I shall keep my sons. Go now and do not disappoint your king. To the Elderwood, my dynamic duo. Let's go, knight. Knight, flutter. Whisper, whisper, I'm going with you. Are you allowed? Shh, not so loud. I'd be hard to spot in the Elderwood, but it never needs snow. I'll just change my clothes and I'll be right out. Rendezvous outside the castle. Better not leave without me, Knight. Yeah, wait me. Wait a minute. Why you blame me? Knight, head to the fourth to the old wood. First, go to the grassy plains. And, yeah, I know. The way is just no, no. I don't care about directions. I have a GPS. Wow, we only have like four minutes almost of story time. I don't think we're gonna get make it to the other wood. Knight, flutter. Oh, my queen. So a doomstone has fallen upon the outer wood. Uh, yes, your majesty. We were just heading there now. That forest forms a border between the human's world and the spirit world. Humans are more or less forbidden to enter there. The king was saying something about that earlier. The world's... The words seem to get a sort of struck in his, stuck in his throat, though. Tee That's a big hinter, my husband. But I have a feeling that you two might be alright. If anyone can find a treasure bestowed upon the spirits, it's you two. Treasure bestowed upon the spirits? So you mean the fourth goddess treasure is somewhere in the Elderwood? Yes, I believe that to be the case. No kidding, it's in the forest. The forest we're headed to now. So you're saying the Elderwood is the fourth land of Rivera? Indeed it is, led by the great spirit Danuta. Great spirit Danuta. <laughs> Don't know if I'm saying that right. It's guarding the treasure. There's no way an ordinary person can get to it. No one gets a foot in the place we're doing it uh, resides without the blessing of the spirits. Your Highness, why are you telling us the secret? Knight, Flutter, I have something to ask of you. When you m meet the children of the forest, please give this to them. Children of the forest? Yes, you know them when you see them. Time to read the letter to the ruler of the Elderwood. I regret that I can no longer be complicit in enforcing the law which bans humans from your forest. The time has come for change, for our children's sake. Your old friend, Ophelia. Um, if you don't mind, that was intended as a private letter. <laughs> Dang, man, my character don't care about privacy. The forest is a beautiful place, but sometimes it swallows people up forever. If you should become lost, let the spirit's tree guide you. Spirit tree, an ancient tree within the heart of the forest. It is a sacred place for monsters and spirits across our river. I believe you will find the help you seek beneath its leafy branches. Got it. Please do be careful. And please don't let anything happen to Laura. Uh, but how? I can read my daughter like a book. Yes, I can guess exactly what she said. I'm going with you. Am I right? Oh, your majesty, that's exactly what Laura said. <laughs> uh, that thing. Please just be careful and watch out for my Laura. Nah. Well, in two minutes, we're not going to be going to the Elder Wood. We're going to go boss hunting. Knight, you waited. I know you would. We just got out. Off we go. Hunting Doomstones again. Remember what Hugh said? The Elder Wood is full of monsters. Yeah, but they're really cool monsters. Trust me. What kind of monsters are they? Well, I heard there are these bears with razor sharp fangs and the whacking trees. The whacking trees are friendly. That sounds horrible. No, no, they're really cool. Uh, well, as long as they're cool. That should be fine then. No problem. As the doomstone affects them. Yikes. We need to hurry before the doomstone turns all the monsters into shadow monsters. Right. I'm getting tired of those doomstones giving everyone a bad impression of monsters. We gotta hurry and do what we can to help clear their names. But some of them are actually evil. What's wrong, Laura? I I just remember my mother telling me something about the Elderwood years ago. Oh, my memory's so fuzzy. Well, it's probably not important. Night, Flutter, let's go. If you can't remember, it's not important. All right. All right, so we're about to hit 30 minutes, so I'm gonna go grind for 30 minutes. That's a good way thing here. Well, let's see what happens. They're gonna probably lead me to Elderwood, but Oh. So, or my first steps are to go to visit the champion, see if I can buy any of his god armor. 
And if he doesn't have any god armor, I go to the pink fairy, who might have god armor. Uh, armor. That's all the way back in Port Puerto, in a way. And now I have Laura with me, so... I could kill monsters a little bit faster now. Quote, unquote, faster. Butterfly? No. Butterfly. <laughs> Not... Don't kill the butterfly. Yeah, I know where Elderwood is. It's over there. Okay, I'm one shot him now. Oh, that's actually cool. Alright, come on. Oh, I gotta go. Okay, now I know. Now I remember where I had to farm. I have to farm at the uh, pyramid, I think, or whatever it's called. I need to keep this area though. My duty is to put poor people the monster takes them to the reward. Grace playing on. So, 10 razor, razor beaks for me, dude. Alright, boom. Easy money. We need to get the money. The razor beaks are the little chickens up here. I think I might do it all in one go. Oh, I two shot him. Yeah, see, the one last second I saw was. Easy. It sucks that this place, I, I remember I took very long here in this place, uh, Mount Snow Peak. Yeah, and this playthrough only took me like a couple minutes or like one episode and then I'm done. Which is crazy. And what I'm trying to say is, I remember I took a very long time in this place. And then later on it became the Dry Sand Desert. No, don't mind that. The Paladin Sword does 10 more damage. I don't need a shield. Maybe because I mastered the sword skill, that's why he gave me it. I'll buy the paladin sword. No, nah, that's a shield. Right. Why does he even want money anyways? Use better powder than Captain himself. Better hope he doesn't catch you with it. I'm gonna actually keep that. I'm not gonna sell it. I don't know what to keep and what to sell. I sell something I need to sell. This. Alright, so he doesn't give me anything. I might have to do these chickens before I leave. I don't know. I have the best armor right now. Until I go to the ferry, I don't know. Burpee. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So now we're going to the pink ferry, which is over there near between Port Puerto and the West Grassy Plains. <clears throat> Jeez, man. <clears throat> Remember these places' names is crazy. Okay, I don't have time for you guys. You guys don't even give me that much XP. And you don't hurt even Laura, so. I still have to go this way anyways. I need to go to Dry Sand Desert anyways. And then the dragon. I wonder if I can still hurt him. Huh. 
That is a lot of damage. Run, Laura, run. <laughs> Ooh, one hit, dang. Yeah, I do, a, I do 30 to 40 damage. That means it's good. After a while, you just remember these places. And if you have more, like, maybe 50 hours or so, then you should know these places by heart. Man. The amount of times I came running like this, it's crazy. Alright, so the fairy should be here in the top right. I don't remember if I have to kill snakes. Is my damage capped at 50? That's garbage. Hello. That's this is who I was looking for when I came up here. Twinkle giggle. Tee hee hee. Oh hello, I was just giggling to myself. My name is Sprinkle Sprinkle Twinky. Twink Twinkle. Um you can see me, can't you? Odd. Most people don't spot me twinkling away. Twinkle giggle all but you. Do you want to see my collection? If you see something you like, you can buy it. Oh, and if you have something cool to sell, would you show me? I love collecting new things. Depends. Hey, flowers. Oh, no, no, this. Whoa. Mini specs. A teddy bear. So, you don't have a lot of good stuff, but the glasses are cool. And this song. Ooh. I'll buy five of these. Alright, when I say buy, I mean I'm gonna just not do it. I wanna see how this works. Uh, cause. Don't they. They can't they customize my. stuff? Okay, here explanation. Okay, enough singing, here's what's up. I can alter the color of the clothes and furniture you're carrying. Have you heard of bellflowers? You see them all around the vestment and such. Red flowers have red petals, we the moon, and so on. If you can get three of the same type, I can apply that color to your clothes or furniture. Furniture, I can dye the simple simple mat, simple curtain, and carpet. Clothes and accessories will vary. Some things can't be dyed. I can't dye given to your friends, so don't have to be nervous about doing Don't be, I can change them back if you don't like it. Just bring me three bottles of the same kind of water, like spring water or any kind of water, really. And that's how it's done. Can I dye my armor? I want to see how... Do I not have to be having equipped? Wait, do I not have to have it equipped? Oh, no, here we go. Get rid of my armor. Look at me. Very questionable design. <laughs> oh god. Why is dying stuff so weird? I can't skip your text that fast, huh? Well, I can't die anything. Well, I'm glad I did this. I'm so glad I did that. Oh, here we go. Get that back on. Get this back on. I already have a beast necklace. Okay. Well, that was a cool little pit stop. I got bells now. Anyway, so what time to go to the place? I need to go to Dry Sand Desert's Pyramid. I think it's a pyramid. 
I don't remember what it's called. I just know it's in dry sand desert. We can also go, I think, to Cacto Cove. Don't remember if that's true or not. Cacto Cove is a little bit different. Oh, I need to kill you. You do enough damage, you cancel their attacks. We did this just so we could go up here and give it to you. No, don't stab him. For the love of everything. Yes, yeah, give me money. I wasted 2,000. Beef. I also take this. Wait, what does the plush for me do? Are they all... Rhino beetles, sun clusters, mummies, earth mana, spring water, four bowls. Okay. Alright. I'm wasting time. I am very slow at this. We just need to go to Dry Sand Desert. I don't need to do anything else. Screw that guy. I just kill everything in sight. How about that? I don't think I need to kill these guys. Jackals? No. Yeah, because I already did a mission for killing the jackals last time. But I need to kill you. The only reason for him is because he gives money. Compared to the other jackals. Run. Cacto Cove is down. I think we need to go there. I'm gonna go see if it's open, actually. No, it is open, alright. Good to know, good to know. We'll go there eventually with we'll a party. Oh, no, 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 wait. I didn't know this. Jesus, spam it. Yes, 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 yes. Pterodactyls, outlaws, cactus people. Wow, I am still not one shotting these guys, so this is gonna be a little fun. Fun little thing. Duh. Oh, die. Easy. Level up. I could kill this guy. But I don't know if I want to. Some enemies just take too long and I don't want to do it. I need this. I'm very scared of accidentally pressing the wrong button. Yoink. Sack of silver. The pyramid is up here. Which is guarded by a boss, which could be kind of scary. Yo, wood. Boom. Easy kill. I remember the first time I ran through here. It did kind of spook me a little bit, but I just ran past them. Because after a while you realize that enemies just take a long time to to attack. Long sword is level nine. That's good. So you're gonna see right here, unless he don't spawn. Yeah, he spawns there, and you can just walk right past him. It's hilarious. 
I gotta go here and I gotta kill a bunch of mummies, apparently. No, go back, go back. Uh, we want strength. Luck is at the highest, I, I like it. We just need more strength because I want to hit things harder. A little bit more luck, yes. Also, this thing is cool. You gotta kill enemies before you can proceed. I think I want to go left. Left is where the... Now the treasure is. I want the treasure, I go right. If you realize, they have the same animation as the zombies. Almost. Also, the, zo the mummies look a little bit different than the last time I remembered. These guys, I hate. Boom. Left again. I think I hated them because when you're trying to get out of... Uh, yeah. When you're trying to get out with a crate, these guys... Really attack fast. If I remember, that's the reason why. Suspicious object. Right back. Uh, yeah. Alright, buddy. Now you look different. But now I remember you. That did not attack. <laughs> No, we want to keep going left. This leads me to a tomb. If I remember correctly. Nah. What? Oh. This might be a little bit problematic. Yep, there's a stun. At least you heal. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't stun, don't stun. Did you get rid of the stun effect? You better have that. That's a cool thing to have Laura for if she... Okay. If Laura makes it so that I don't get stunned, that's good. Going to Elderwood. Nah, let's go in the tomb. I think it was left on this. Oh, I got confused with left and right. Oh, that's great. You guys look different. Like a, the Nap Dragon is just fine with this killing its babies. The hatchlings look different. One thing about having a party member that sucks is they can accidentally attack an enemy you don't want. Thank you for the debuff. Oh, the buff removal. Alright. We're gonna kill this guy. No, no. Just cause I think I'm able to. When you're down. <laughs> Ow. Okay. This might be a harder boss than I thought. Right. I'm not doing 30 to 40 damage like the other Nap Dragon, so I think that's a clue to say, screw you, we're not gonna do this. Which I have to agree, I will, I will screw off entirely. Uh, let's go to right side. Right side is I got mixed up with the right and left. Did I know? Because the right side has the, the gold. Wasn't the right side the ancient gold treasure? The left side was just a tomb. But I don't remember the boss dragon guarding it. Hello, hello. 
Oh, you guys suck. I didn't kill anyone with that move. And he died. Lights out. Oh, is this a tomb? No, this is not a tomb. I remember there's like stuff. Sack of gold, sack of gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, apparently I don't remember this tomb that well. Yeah, I know you can't go down. Oh, that guy runs away, but I don't think he gives you that much stuff. Laura, Laura. No, oh, no. Okay. Just kind of just watch me slept there. That guy just put me to sleep instantly. Dang. I remember running into him a lot in the tunnels. Do I usually just ignore these guys? I'm here for the bosses, not them. I mean... Easy dodge. Boom. I like that ability, Laura. But you just need to do more damage. There he is. All right, let's go kill him. I don't think he's gonna give us a lot of stuff though. Usually he has a lot of. Well, goodbye. See ya, man. But love everything. Stand still. Metal. Do a lot of damage. Oh, now he does more damage. Alright, fall back. That's a lot of overheal, but. Die! Laura, you're literally not doing anything to him. Quite literally, I think I'm using you just for a meat shield. Smite. He just gets a lot of experience. You suck. Die. Uh, let's do that to this. Jesus, how many points that? Two. Keep keep putting that on strength. Fatality, maybe I'll upgrade it later. But not now. Boom. I think I want to go up here. Do this. Gold gauntlets, that's going straight to the market. It's here? No, what's on the right side? It's another boss fight, I remember. Oh my god, it's so weird. My brain is just like, I can't remember this stuff. 
I should get my mummy's mission done. That's a wrap. <laughs> That's gonna be more mummies. That doesn't take a lot to bring Laura back. I don't mean it, it requires anything from me, you just revive him. Oh, I didn't kill him? Well, that's great. I don't know if I still did my mission for my captain for that. I know I'm not ready for him. I think, anyways. How much damage do I do? <laughs> Laura, you had no chance. He shoots lightning. He does a lightning attack that goes four ways. Laura, you almost just got knocked out. Yeah, he's kind of scary. Then what's on the right side, then? I always thought the right side was one of those bosses, but I guess not. Come with me. You're going to be put somewhere safe. Then we go right says it's right going, right? Uh, well, here we go. I gotta go all the way back. Almost to the beginning to go right side. Because that kind of sucks. I only have like, what, three minutes? Ugh. Maybe I might not be able to do this since more back. I think, no, this is the exit. Is it? No, it's not. Cause I'm like, wait, there's no way that's the exit. Some more right. If you wanna go right, you gotta go right. You never go forward on this way. Oh, and respawns there, bat. Easy. Yeah, that guy. Poison. Didn't even get hit by him. Easy. I'm gonna put this next to this other guy because now this is safe. No enemies really spawn in the middle of the hallways. Nearly just at the end of them. The serpent. It's another boss. Oh, I just heal. That would have been Venom. Oh well. Die. That's another boss. That's three bosses. We want to go right again. Because going left is not a good idea. I think I remember that correctly. So many enemies. We don't want to kill you. That's a very common enemy right there. Spider. Okay, I'm going to make it. Jesus. Right side. We don't want to fight you. Actually, we do. I think. You're not. Oh. Yeah, because he doesn't drop any crates. He's just there. This. We found a treasure. What the fuck? Yeah, I found a treasure mid fight. Jesus. 
skeleton of a large monster was wearing a pet collar. Maybe it was the treasure guardian. Probably. Sack of treasure. Yeah. Hello, spider. Alright, you think you can try and rob my kills? Oh, it's you. No, we don't fight him either. Jeez, how do I forget the three three bosses in here? Alright, we hit we hit an hour. I might just go collect my gains and then probably leave this place. Man, quite literally, how do I forget those three? Those three are really annoying bosses. That I soloed because I didn't want to bring a party with me. But I want to get that treasure chest. I go left and then up and then right. Come here, you buddy. I know you're salty, but this is what happens when you get captured. All three of you. Was it down? It was. Going from left is kind of easy to memorize, but going right side kind of is hard to remember. No. No, they break. No, one of them broke. Rip. I don't know which one broke. See, I could take it the safe route, but eh. Doesn't really doesn't really matter if they break or not, because those bosses were kind of easy to kill. They weren't the legendary bosses. I'll cry if it's the legendary bosses. Give me money. I made my money back. Magical powder. All right. Let's see what missions have I done. Oh, yeah, I think I did this guy's mummy's mission. Thank you very much for having me. This is your reward. Life cures and money. Cha-ching. All right. Okay, let's see, what else did we not do? Nap Dragon, no, let's start having a Cacto Co, Cacto Co, Deep Sea. Aquarium King, Banana King, nope, 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 but you wish, you wish, nope, we did that. Uh, we gotta go back again, let's go more hatchlings. And that's pretty much it, Silver Dragon, and then the Golden Dragon. We're going to Cacto Cove. King Serpent Deep Sea Cave. I don't know what it is. Anyways, guys, uh, if you enjoyed this video, uh, leave a like. I say leave a dislike. Comment down below anything you want to say. Uh, hopefully, this gets recorded well. Uh, if it doesn't, I'll uh, just probably upload it. Changed a lot of settings, so I hope this came out all right. And yeah, leave a comment about anything you want to say. And and I guess, oh, night, guys, I guess I'll see you in the next video or live stream. Bye, guys.